When you think of a love story, you might typically think of a setting such as a castle or some small faraway village. But inside the doors here at Cure Coffee House, this is where several stories have either continued or started. We met our, our, met our significant other here, their first dates were here, uh, they got engaged after they came here on a little date. You'd normally hear the sound of coffee dripping and the espresso machine hissing, but not love stories. So what makes this place keen for love to brew? It's a mystery to us too, but we certainly take that in high regard. It's um, something that we love hearing. Carrie Austin is Cure's creative director and has been collecting love stories happening there. Too many to count. In fact, she found love here. I actually met my husband here uh, five years ago now when he was a customer and I used to work behind bar a lot more. And he started kept coming in every time I was working and, you know, we... Uh, slowly forged a bond. So did Jen and David Adams. When we met at Cure the first time, we I think we both felt an instant connection. We sat there for probably four hours just drinking coffee and sharing information about our lives. Then in February of 2020, they got married and chose to have their wedding at Cure Coffee House before moving to Japan where David is stationed. We just thought we would pop in there for a quick wedding, try not to interrupt anyone with their service and what they did for us was just simply amazing. The store decorated the shop. Their friends came and customers there celebrated along. And that's how I describe it as kind of like a fairy tale. Now, as to when the next love story will begin at Cure, that remains a mystery. In Norfolk, Julio Avila, News 3.